Hi, I'm Belinda and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a safe, stable and effective vitamin A serum using the Create Cosmetic Formulas program. So let's first select a serum as the product we want to create today. I'm picking the lotion-like serum so it's got a creamier consistency. First, I want to pick some propane dial so it's a nice light skin feel, but still plenty of humectancy. And I'm going to put this in at 7%. I'm going to pick Solar Gum Tara. And I'm going to select Montanov 68 Satyral Alcohol Satyral Glucoside Blend as my non ionic emulsifier. I want a reasonably low viscosity from my serum, so I'm gonna keep the input of this material quite low. Now, because I'm making a vitamin A serum, I wanna pair this with some oils that have a natural sort of vitamin A story. So I'm gonna pick some avocado oil and some baobab oil. And I'm just going to adjust the inputs of these materials. I'm also going to companion these with a little bit of caprylic capric triglycerides just so I can get a more moisturizing skin feel without residual greasiness. Now I'm going to be picking my vitamin A. And I'm going to input this at 0.7%, which is still within its upper limit. Now I'm going to pair this with some extracts. First of all, I'm going to pick some bearberry extract. Now this particular material doesn't have clinical efficacy data, but it's associated with skin renewal, skin brightening effects. So I'm going to pick the bearberry extract. And because vitamin A is known to be a little irritating to some skin types, I'm also going to pick chamomile extract and cucumber extract to give a nice soothing cooling effect. And I'm going to input each of these at 1%. Now I want a really light, subtle fragrance and I want to make sure it's still really caring for the skin. So I'm going to pick some lavender oil and pair this with some Lang Lang. You, of course, can pick and choose your own. I'm going to input these at 0.1% each, just so there's a small input there. For my antioxidant, I'm going to pick a tocopherol 70% and put it in at the maximum recommended input, 0.8%. And for my preservative, I'm going to pick Uxal PE 9010 and leave it at the minimum recommended input. Now it's time to generate my method. And here is my formula. Now let's take a look at how we put this together in the lab.
And there you go, that's how easy it is to create a safe, stable and effective vitamin A serum. I hope you enjoyed seeing just how easy it is to create a safe, stable and effective vitamin A serum using the Create Cosmetic Formulas program. Please give the video a thumbs up, leave any questions or comments below and make sure you subscribe to Create Cosmetic Formulas so that it can be this easy for you. Remember you can add your own extracts and adjust the formula to be exactly what you want. Happy formulating!